Windward community activists today slammed Mayor Peter Carlisle's appointment of David Tenoy to head the city's planning and permitting department. The community critics called Tenoy everything from corrupt to secretive. The mayor and Tenoy called the allegations false. KITV 4's Denby Fawcett has the story. I am strongly and unalterably opposed to this recommendation from the mayor and I ask you to reject it. Windward community group said they felt betrayed. They said they worked for two years on a sustainable plan for the Ko'olaloa coast, only to find Tanoe's office propose a plan that included developments of 875 new homes on agricultural land at Laie and a large resort expansion at Turtle Bay. David Tanoe has held private meetings with developer interests and circumvented procedures established by his own department. Critics said Tanoe's plan ignored the community's wish to retain the rural character of the area. Never in all my years of citizen participation in government have I experienced such shoddy treatment. Others said Tanoe was Mufi Hanneman's handmaiden. I believe that Mr. Tanoe follows instructions from the mayor, the ex-mayor, and obviously we know that Mufi Hanneman has a very strong affinity with those groups. Tanoe said Hanneman was never involved in the planning of the Mormon development at Laie. He said he expected opposition today to his nomination. After the meeting today, a couple of the people came up to me, shook my hand, says nothing personal. But like you mentioned, you know, implications of corruption, completely deny any of those things. All our meetings have been open. You know, I've met on a regular basis with people on both sides. Carlisle says he fully backs Tanoe and he wants him to be on his cabinet permanently. Projects, because individual projects, there's always going to be controversy. But if you take a look at the overall wealth of the work that he's done for the city, uh, he's admirable and he's somebody that I'd like to see staying on. Now, David Tanoe is among eight of Mufi Hanneman's former cabinet members. Mayor Carlisle is hoping the council will approve to stay on until January. By then, Carlisle hopes to name his own officials. But as the mayor just said, he wants to retain Tanoe permanently. Paula. All right, Demby, thank you.